Hey guys, Big Willie here from Big Willie's Fab Shop. Today's episode is we'll be working on this 1948 Farmall B that we just picked up on old Marky Place. Um, stay tuned for this wild ride. We did buy it not running. Um, previous owner did mention he was able to get it running a couple years ago, um, but hasn't tried since, so we'll see what it takes. Little walk around on this 1948 Farmall B. Um, overall, it's a 20 footer. 20 feet away, it looks pretty good. Any closer than that, you start seeing some things here and there that we'll be addressing um, this winter. Like the first item here is the front bolster. Had been previously ripped off and re-welded. Um, you know, still holding, but it's not the most uh, appealing looking welds here. So we'll be grinding all that off and re-welding it and or finding a new front bolster for this and bolting it up and making it look a little cleaner since the plan here is this will be a parade rig so we're going to be tearing it apart uh, repainting it fixing any other issues that we'll find along the way um, like a couple things uh, will be coming up here so stay tuned and uh yeah hope you enjoy all right let's see what we're getting ourselves into She's toast. So to me, this thing must have sat outside with a cover off or something. I'll show you where the water came from. Nice. And this is one hell of a winter project. Up during the oil and then uh, the charger. charger compression test. Yeah. Pop the spark plugs out and see what crap flies out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. That's the antifreeze, too, dude. Ah, uh, great. Yeah. So, head gasket or. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Spark plugs. Doesn't look like there's a cracked cylinder wall. Mm -hmm. Or a cracked head going into the combustion chamber. So there has to be a port between the. That's to be an oil. Cracked oil galley. Well, they named the tractor for you, POS. And they have that battery box. Look at that. Put on start. Cook the battery a little more. Battery charger? Yeah, I'm gonna turn it up. Try it. Let her 
bake for a while. I was just wondering if we didn't get a spark. I don't know where is our spark hole meter? Is that something we're in the like a kitten. <laughs> Started. <laughs> oh shit. I'm not sure. Do we have throttle or what the hell? Or I mean you know that's not moving the that's froze. That's why. It was like I was trying to move it and then yeah. it was like she's going wide open. I think it must have got moisture in there too. What was that? The cloud of days. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of all of our air conditioning in there. Yeah. Well, let me go get that exhaust too. Oh yeah, that's it. Well, for a while. I think, I think it, oh, back is, sh I kind of, it's not real great, but I don't know. I moved your back and forth a little bit. Round two? What finally killed it, anyway? I don't know. Some JV actually even on there. No, that looks, that oil? that's metal. But no, is that is it leaking gas or is that oil? Yeah, it's leaking gas. It's gas. Oh. So much for a nice gas there. You can see the thing. Yeah, <sighs> see someone did something there.
Just a note here on all the smoke that it actually is. Marble mystery oil that's kind of burning off. Ports them down, down the cylinders. Help lubricate it before we fired it up. Um, kind of a mystery what it is, but uh, no one really knows. So, well, the tractor is in pretty decent shape. We expected on these old things. They're road hard, put away wet, so they're used and abused. So there's there's definitely some things that uh, we need to fix up on it. But uh, that will be our next episode. Um, stay tuned. Um, we got some kind of big plans for this tractor. Hopefully this winter we'll be tearing it apart, redoing everything, and putting it back together and painting it. Um, since this will be kind of our new parade rig. Update on the antifreeze and the oil. We suspect that it is a bad o-ring on the sleeve, um, since these are a wet sleeve engine. Um, so we kind of suspect that's where the antifreeze is leaking by into the crankcase. Um, but we'll know more once we tear into it this winter and uh, redo it. So stay tuned for that. Like, subscribe um, if you like this kind of content, and make sure you don't miss out what we're up to next. Big Willie out.